Hello everyone, I am the Plane Shifter fading to the universe of Hitman. We're still gonna redo a few hits in new ways. I've just done the word of tomorrow. This is the one. A gilded cage. I think it is stone. The one. Yeah, Sapienza is the word of tomorrow, right? Yeah. So we're going to a Marrakesh. A gilded cage. Ah, oh, the guy I threw up. A toilet on his head. And a moose on the other guy's head. I can try the oil lamp. Poisoning food. Electrified. Klaus Hugo by Sternberg by electrocuting him. Drowning. Doing the headmaster and finding the children's painting. Burning oil drum. Oh, Poison General has in the printing press. I need to do this one. That 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 sounds poetic. That sounds so very poetic. Explosion during the interview. There is also the APC tour. It's not, it's not all that interesting. This guy is as the prisoner. This chill drop is redacted. Oil drums, okay. Don't use that tone. That's the one I want to use with the uh, general. I would like to be interesting one, like the best one I already did. Mmm, <laughs> well that's an interesting one, unhappy ending, yeah. Okay, I think I figure I found what I want to do. So unhappy ending and don't use that tone. Alright. I'm gonna keep my fiber wire this time. So I can start at the bazaar entrance and undercover in the court. Huh. And smuggling. Lamp shop alley, small agency pickup, mechanic shop. Large agency pickup, consolidate parking garage. Hmm. School gay. Ghostly top floor. Hmm. 
Let's do the mechanic shop and get me a lockpick there. And I don't think I will change the place I begin. Don't think it's gonna be necessary. Okay, let's do this. Loading, loading, loading. Every time you Welcome loading. to Marrakesh, 47. The situation grows more tense by the minute. The cons. Okay. If I remember correctly, yeah, there's a break here. You can never have too many. Blunt weapons. Will I be trespassing if I enter the kitchen? I don't want to even stand outside nice this kitchen. You, sir. Why can't I turn F1? Okay. Mechanic shop. That's where I want to be. Hello. Yeah, please go ahead. Too many people. Hello, come in, come in. I can see you have an eye for high quality pottery. Uh, of course I do. There you go. That's a pretty good one. Pretty good pickup point. Okay. What is this? I have voltage power hey out there, right? Manly man you. No idea what this is supposed to do. Whatever. How's your father? Doing well, thanks for asking. He's upstairs right now working on this novel of his, some kind of political thriller, I think. You know, airport lit. Oh, that's nice. So he doesn't miss the old school? Well, he was headmaster for 30 years. And he still carries around the master key. You know, the one that fits all the locks. Doesn't seem to be able to part with the damn thing. But that's nostalgia for you. Well, maybe now he'll be a famous writer instead. Right. And maybe my carpets are magical. <laughs> Give your old man some credit, Marwin. He might surprise you yet. Anyway, got to run. See you around. Yep, up, up, and away. Okay, the return here, the master, we should know about. Where's Bad Blood, Sherry Blossom, down the rabbit hole, Golden Touch, oh, okay. There we go, why we fight? Extract this one. People don't find it strange that I carry. No, he is capitalism. I mean, that's what we all want this day and age, right? Uh, not me. That's a load of rubbish. We all want these Western materialistic things. Flat screen, sneakers. Hello, well, sir. He just found a loophole. I hate his guts, but he's clever. Yeah, yeah, give him credit. He's got some balls. Find the propaganda printing crew? Okay. Uh... I'm serious. He's at the shisha den right now, laughing his ass off. <laughs> oh man, that is so like Jeff. 
But come on, GNN is one of the biggest news networks in the world. I you totally forgot what I was going to say. Well, apparently they're doing an interview with Klaus Stronberg, you know that white collar asshole who's held up at the Swedish consulate? Well, they needed a cameraman so bad that their producer just threw some money at Jeff and forgot to ask for ID. They think his name is Finley. But this could be like the interview of the year with GNN. Why wouldn't he just do it? Who knows where a gig like that could lead? Uh, you know, Jeff, lazy as shit. <laughs> True that. Okay. We're gonna unlock this. Maybe I should have gotten the key. Am I trespassing with you? Come here, no. It's not the... Uh, the fancy place that I need an invitation to be. I'm at the lobby checking out and I hear this big shot uh, producer from GNN I'm... on the phone with an agency desperate to get a cameraman for an interview with Claus Hugo Strandberg. Strandberg, the, the banker. Do you ever watch the news? Anyway, I tap him on the back, show him my press pass, and the guy is so relieved that he just pays me a month's salary up front. Of course I'm not gonna do it. There's no way I'm getting near that place. Besides, I've got all this nice free money, and the dunce doesn't even know my real name. <laughs> Would you believe I said my name was Finley? Right, so I'm at the shisha place down near the bazaar. Whenever you can sneak out, come and join me, okay? Smoke is on me. Well, I know who I need to tackle if I want to be the cameraman. <laughs> not gonna happen though, not this time. of security actually funny I thought about her earlier what with all the Strandberg protests and stuff what's she doing here huh I wonder if she was laid off wouldn't be the worst timing I mean rather out here than in there right amen you know maybe I should uh... <laughs> oh no you don't last time you How's it going? to say hi you wound up in Luxembourg bought a Ferrari forgot where you parked it and then came home 48 hours later with a bag of croissants and a stupid grin on your face. This time, you're spending the day with me. <laughs> Point taken. <laughs> okay. Can I just throw my way over to that place? Hey, got one left. I'll go find a spot and then we head back to the school. How's that? Sure, we'll wait. Uh, the printing crew spreads fake propaganda in the name of Crystal Dow, encouraging the Morocco to rise up and take just to their own hands, which, of course, is exactly what the idea is counting on. Very clever. The crew must have access to nearby printing supplies, most likely at the Bernard School. Getting a printing crew, these guys. Uh, okay. Jeez, what does General Zayden want? Paper the whole city with these things? Yeah, you know what they say. The bigger the lie, the more people will believe it. Yeah, I don't know. What if the real Crystal Dawn finds out? They won't look too kindly on us creating revolutions in their name. It's fraud. They're a terrorist organization. Who are they gonna complain to? <laughs> um, us? Look, if they do find out, you and me are the far bottom of a very long list. Now, I worry less about Crystal Dawn and more about the guys who keep on waiting. Ah, yeah. Hang the great. Thought about that. I don't know her voltage power outlet. Where is a good place for me to tackle this guy? And steal his clothes. And a good day to you, sir. Cafe fun, eh?
Welcome. Enjoy yourself. Very polite. Okay, that would be a great place to do it, but I wasn't in my coin hand. Clever, but uh, no, I'm not a reader. What the heck is this? Soda cans. I am a cleaner. Thank you. Yes. We're having beef tonight. I prefer camel, but the wife is watching all that damn French television. Can you get me something that makes beef taste like camel? Thank you. Thank you. Wise choice. Yeah. Um, come back in five minutes. I'll pack this all up for you. Meanwhile, you know, have a look around. Yeah. Oh boy, he's going on the most crowded area in the hey, what's up? region. I mean, technically, would anybody notice? I would hazard their guess that yes. I'm trying to steal your clothes. You're not making it easy for me. Thanks for making it easy for me. Crystal Dawn, yeah! Oh, hi, welcome, welcome. Please, what would you like? My special house blend is famous in all, all of right. North Africa. Oh, thanks, that's uh, really interesting, but I'm not just... Hello. Hello, you look clever. Are you a reader? You look like a I am clever. I waited for the perfect opportunity before I stripped. Let me just wrap it nicely for you. It may take a while. Come back in uh, ten minutes. What the... Another printing press kind of work hey, for the. Man. Dude, but would the soldiers giving me trouble? Apparently not. And apparently nobody will notice that I'm not me. 
Okay. Talk to the printing girl. Done. Let's head back. Yeah, why not? I'm out anyway. Mm -hmm. I wonder if I tackled him earlier, I would have to. Like. <laughs> Those people they have no idea what's about to happen. Don't hey, give Carlos about it. my Just best do job. job. Some soldiers back at the school. I've heard them talking. They have fake the crystals on headgear and old Afghan rifles, and they were planning to shoot the protesters. You know, to get things rolling. Like I said, don't think about it. When brass like Zayden play their games, there's always collateral damage. Just make sure you're not it. That's a shitty outlook, man. We are part of this. You, me, okay. right here, right now. Right. Yeah. Why don't you chain yourself to the printing press when we get back? I'm sure that'll thwart Zayden's evil scheme. Me? I'm gonna go stick flowers in the rifle barrels. Yeah, well, I've got a conscience, so shoot me. Keep this shit up, and somebody will. Assalamu alaikum. You want a lamp? These are dark times, no? Don't worry, I'm Bye. gonna um, stop that. Thank you, thank you. The guy will be dead in no time. <laughs> Just kidding. We are all madly in love with your little shop. No problem. Take a look around the mall. Will I just get to enter the school? Oh boy, I should have gotten the key. Thankfully, I also have a lockpick, so that should not not the best option, but uh, soon option. How far away are we from our destination, dudes? Don't read everything you see in the press, huh? Uh, warm and well the the phrase is do not believe everything you see in the press. Read every, reading everything is not a uh, bad idea. You just never have enough time. Those guys don't. Uh... Yeah, why don't you go print? It's about time. Go straight to the printing room. General Zayden has an announcement to make, and you boys do not want to keep him waiting. Hey, tell Michael in the print shop to stop texting my girlfriend. Yeah, you should totally just slide uh, little notes under her desk. We're from the printing crew. Come on. I heard it. His brother was one of the police who got killed in the first attacks on the river. Well, he got called for it. Condemned prisoner? No, I'm doing this. Might. should maybe try the prisoner. Probably could get some interesting info from that. Some talking points. Yeah, we always have more opportunities. I'm gonna. Well done, 47. This ought to get Zaydan's attention. Attention, everyone! You may that have done a is fine General Reza Zaydan, keeper of the on peace. Everyone's lips. That is why we are expanding the campaign to the other city districts and suburbs. Yeah, go Crystal Dawn! This means dog. there will be no breaks and the job's done. So whatever you do, just keep those printers running. Okay. I'm here. What else now? I just completed this. Okay, Intel is lost, okay. Sherry Blossom.
pushing him into the prison. Let's get him. I can turn off. Okay. Can conceal item, can dump some people over there. What is this? Fighting. Alright, dude. Something may happen. Where is the general? Over here. King here. Hey, get those printers running. Okay, that guy messed me up big time. Hmm, I'm not entirely sure how to do this. Okay. I now cannot put the general here. Hey! Keep those flyers coming. That's what we're paying you for. Okay, that was poetic. Two poetic kills on this guy already. 
And holy crap, this thing's powerful. It totally... It, it turned the guy into ink. Holy crap. Now how do I get out of here? That's what he get for being a bad boss. Talking about I'm bad boss. <laughs> Chiseled Omar Sharif Cha. Did you see that model he's dating? I'd like to line up. Where is this locked? This is locked. Unfortunately, I don't have I don't have the key. How do I just exit the building without? Seriously, where is the exit? Where is the prisoner? Okay, let me look at the map. Oh, I just keep going. Ah, over there. It's through here. That's why I wasn't finding it. I thought I just... Can I just go out? I can just go out. No need to worry about the uh, keys and stuff. You can't trust those Crystal Dawn rebels. Agreed. Okay, I'm out. Yo, what's up, print boy? The time is held for the printing press. Apparently, the printing crew is out putting up posters in the streets. Mm -hmm. Well, three of them are just sleeping on the job. And the boss is dead. Okay, uh, where did I leave my civilian clothes? Over here. Crime notice? Huh? Since when changing clothes is a crime. <laughs> changing clothes is a crime now? I guess I got naked in a public in public, so Okay, that's eliminated reses I done, which are I done.
thing I read this thing. How the heck did that guy notice? Yeah, go crystal talk! You rule! Woohoo! Who to you two? Now. Now. Okay. Now, to track this opportunity. I guess this helps you get started with the most uh, uh, obscure stuff, yes, but yes, then it yes. leaves to you to figure out how to do the final blow. Which is okay, I think. Not leave you completely hanging. I'm so sorry. Dude, really. Dude, get out of the way! Are you kidding me? Are you hey, who the hell are you? This guy is unbelievable. Anybody know him? That's far enough. No. Are you kidding me? Is this happening? You better stop now, or, or I'll find someone who can make you stop. Yeah. What the hell? Crime? Crime? No, no, I'm no, committing the crime. Everybody! Put your hands over your head. What the? Stand still, sir. <laughs> Do not move a muscle. What thing the? You freak? are done if you don't surrender. <laughs> Why? <Go. laughs> no way. I need help. Now I they move. <laughs> That's the stupidest thing. <laughs> Oh my goodness! Uh. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> oh my goodness! I, I committed a crime, apparently. Standing still when I cannot move anywhere is a crime in the city. I'm gonna make a manual save after I recover the other costume. Print man. Hello, come in, come in. <gasps> I can see you have an eye for high quality. Okay. Now that guy's coming here. Dumb. Oh my gosh, that is so dumb. <laughs> it was so dumb I can't even stay ma I'd be mad at that. Temporarily out of order. For how long had it been temporarily out of order? I I wonder. Ah, so it's snail time. 
the most dangerous alley in the game. Be extra careful going through here. Because technically I'm... Ooh. Interesting. I'm finding all these interesting places to hide bodies. So it's supposed to be inside. Sorry, but this access point is restricted. I can't let you through. Okay, I need to get in. Seven billion, seven billion, my friends. That is how much this psycho fan from affluent Scandinavia. White collar predators like Claus Strandberg. I'll tell you what they're doing. They're doing what they do best. Nothing. That's what. No, my friends, our government is much too busy paying lips. Okay, so. Time to figure out how to get inside. Don't worry, the... The dictator to be is no longer be. Is this trespassing? Yes. Okay, this is a way in. Put it out of disguise. It's not the greatest way in. And that guy is looking straight at me. Most impressive, 47. Now to locate Klaus Strandberg. These are set and done. Especially considering that I'm in this place without a disguise. Let's see if I can isolate someone. Or as a lot of people. That guy's looking straight at me though. Good places to hide bodies either.
Who's looking at me? Don't move. Do not even flinch. I flinched. I should have just thrown a thing on him. But I got what I needed. That should give me some uh, freedom to move around. Let's see, can I make it a little better? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make it a little better. I'm just gonna throw <laughs> the crowbar at the guy like immediately. Instead of letting him notice me. There you go. Did it a bit better. How many crowbars do I have? <laughs> a collection of everything I can get my hands on. Okay. Now to get to wherever that place is. This disguise is probably not getting me out of the way. Probably not gonna get me all the way there. It's actually getting me quite far away. Huh. Murder weapons. Uh, okay, where is the... Uh, there's some people there that knows what's up. And some people up there too. Technically I'm authorizing now. Totally have gotten this guy too. Hmm, screwdriver. You no, know there are stairways up in this place. You just need to remember where. Security camera. 
Is it suspicious that I'm here? No. Good. That guy knows what's up though. Am I trespassing? So. No, the cops are just very attentive. This is a mic. Massage expert Connie Engstrom reported the reception desk. That was Connie Engstrom. Please go to the reception desk. Yeah, this is not getting me anywhere. I might lose that opportunity. Are there only soldier boys here? Totally. knows what's up but nobody else may be able to sneak in as long as I'm careful hmm the cops the cops know what's up Not suspicious at all. No. That guy needs to move for my I guess he cannot be a soldier inside this place. Okay. Did I capture the attention of anybody? No. How much 
much will uh, cop these guys afford me. Anything I'm carrying is illegal? No, but I'm dropping that big gun anyway. Where's my coin? Just in case. Let's see, that guy knows what's up. Okay, I'm free to go. Kinda. The cops know what's up and should be careful. Okay. According to the appointment schedule, Klaus Strandberg has booked a massage to relieve his back pains. No doubt all that time in prison has caused muscle stiffness. The masseur, who works at a local clinic, has apparently already checked into the building. Okay. Massage expert, Connie Engstrom, report at the reception desk. That was Connie Engstrom. Please go to the reception desk. Alright. Six small. <laughs> I've done. Smaller. It's hilarious. It is not fair. It is. Oh, hi. You can't keep me in here under these circumstances. If I had known... Well, that's easy for you to say. You're not the one supposed to be doing deep tissue massage in a freaking war zone, okay? It is that bad, Donald, it is. Believe me. Yeah, no, do not put me on hold. Oh, boy. Hmm. I really need a cigarette here. Okay. Uh, yes, I'm still here, and I'm still not doing it. Forget about the angry mob, okay? Do you know who this Strandberg guy is? Huh, Donald? Do you? He's a hmm. wanted fugitive. He's like the Prince of Fiscal Darkness. I'm not performing with these hands on the likes of him. It's bad karma, Donald. I mean, what if I lost my gold medal politician? Oh, come on! Generous yeah, Donald, I can't... Spend a few no, hours I can't hear a word you're saying. Someone turn the TV on. I... No, hold on, I'm heading outside. D okay. Donald? Donald? I did something. Donald? Let's see how well uh, this something I did will work. I shall protect you, sir. How much outside are you going? Over there. Yes. This is 100% Egyptian cotton. Like I care. I just need to subdue you. Oh, crap! <laughs> Whoops! It is not fair. It is. It is. You can't keep. Circumstances. 
If I had known. Well, that's easy for you to say. Oh, come on! Yeah, Donald, I can't... No, I can't hear a word you're saying. Someone turn the TV on. I... No, hold on, I'm heading outside. Do Donald? Do Donald? Donald? Okay. I know where he's going, and I'm going there too. Weirdly excited. Well, I'm sure I can manage. Thank you very much. So what guy. This will so, forever be what's next? amusing. What is this? If I see anything, rest assured, I will let you know. It's a freaking chair. What the hell is that Z shaped thing and the little wheel that moves in a counterclockwise. Okay, screw this. You let me down, naked silhouette guy. I'm so... Poisoning his coffee. Yes, hello. This is... Well, I'm... Him being noticed. Maybe I should have cleaned the kitchen before. Can I? Oh, he drinks water. Hmm. Do have some poison here. Yeah, Donald. An ad, of course. Mortgage loan, my ass. Hey, you. Ah. How much people is in this freaking kitchen? Oh, come on. Okay. That's what it says. Okay, what else? Okay. okay. It is not fair. It is. It is. You can't keep me in here under these circumstances. If I had known. Oh come on! Yeah, Donald. I can't. Okay. No, I can't hear a word you're saying. <laughs> this this may be up. using some precognition no, hold here. Hold on, I'm heading outside. Do Donald. Do Donald. Donald. <laughs> You let me down, naked silhouette guy. <laughs> I don't even want to tamper with his. Yes, hello. Thing. This is. Well, I'm calling from the Swedish consulate in Marrakesh. You people sold us the. Uh. Monopoly chair. What kind of a name is that? Is this to poison or to... It's to poison. Oh, I can totally kill that guy with... Uh... Okay, that should send him to the... Bathroom. Oh God! Ah, so, joy. So unpleasant. Don't faint now. Just, just get to the restroom. Get it out.
Move to the restroom, please. Not what I expected. Now it should be completely unrecognizable by everybody. I should not be seen with a kitchen knife. Okay. Makes sense. I'm a masseur. Yeah, I hope that he would run to a... Uh, bathroom but that didn't happen let's see he like illegal item yes okay should find a place to conceal my other gun as well. What the hell was that? That didn't make a lick of sense. Something about the liger. Hey, sorry. Please look where you're going. Next time I use my extra senses. See you anything here? What is that? Okay. I really want to drop off my gun somewhere. Ah, good place. Alright. I'll probably don't need That's guns right, with... Uh, with my hands on his neck. Engstrom, Monsieur, here for an appointment with Klaus Strandberg. Ah, oh, Mr. Engstrom. Please proceed to the massage room. It's upstairs on the right. I'll inform Mr. Strandberg. Upstairs on the right. Okay. Klaus Strandberg, go to the massage room. Your session awaits. I repeat, Klaus I... Strandberg. Uh, sorry, I have to search you, sir. How could I conceal anything uh, on this? Sir, sorry, this, this is just going to take a second. Let me tell you a little story. Back when he first started out. All right, you're good. You're good to go. Don't give a shit, but that's not the point. He married a local woman. 
Ah, so the man with the golden touch. Now let's get started. Shall we? Ah, this muscle tension is killing me. Why don't you lie down, Mr. Strangberg? Oh, please. Call me Klaus. Yeah, yeah, you should leave, you know. You might need to get undressed. Well done, 47. I will leave Strandberg in your capable hands. Let's... Uh, yeah, let's give a message. Oh, uh, what? Ah, oh, that's the ticket. I tell you, nothing makes you tense like thousands of people wanting to kill you. <laughs> yeah, imagine if there was one messaging you right now. <laughs> Hell, their people are funny. The fact is, if those morons had bothered to learn the first thing about market investments, my scheme would never have worked. Greed and ignorance, my friend. Those are the cornerstones to any good con. But you see, easy money, that's all people care about. So they can drive their ridiculous urban SUVs and drink wine on a Thursday, on a Tuesday, whatever, and tell each other how they've made it. It's pathetic. I own a private jet. I made it. But tell you what, you seem like a sensible guy. So I give you this one for free. You should pack up and leave the country. Because things are about to become unpleasant. Oh, I agree. So I feel ah. a lot better. Ah, come on. So things are about to become unpleasant. Hit kill. <laughs> need, need, need to be perfect. Please proceed to the massage room. It's upstairs on the right. I'll inform Mr. Strandberg. Klaus Strandberg, go to the massage room. Your session awaits. Sorry, bud. Uh, I'm gonna have to Klaus frisk you. Klaus Strandberg, please go to the massage room. Uh, just standard procedure will be done very soon. That's nice, Jeff. All right, go on through. Back when he first started out, Strandberg would Okay. Ah, so, the man with the golden touch. Uh, let's get started. Shall we? Ah, uh, this muscle tension is killing me. Why don't you lie down, Mr. Strangberg? Oh, please, call me Klaus. Massage guy. Yeah, right, of course. Well done, 47. I will leave Strandberg in your capable hands. How does she talk to me? Ah, that's the ticket. I tell you, nothing makes you tense like thousands of people wanting to kill you. <laughs> Hell, their people are funny. The fact is, if those morons had bothered to learn the first thing about market investments, my scheme would never have worked. Greed and ignorance, my friend. Those are the cornerstones to any good con. What is you wearing see, glasses? Easy money. That's all people care about. I wear glasses so and that's on the on that pillow it's uncomfortable as hell. It on presses Thursday, against your head. On a Tuesday, whatever, and tell each other how they've made it. It's pathetic. I own a private jet. I made it. But tell you what. You seem like a sensible guy, so I give you this one for free. You should pack up and leave the country, because things are about to become unpleasant. Indeed. So Very unpleasant. Both 
targets down. Now head towards an exit. Okay. Exit, exit. Down below. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. Can I just get out dressed like this? That would be so dear disguise. Exactly. And why did the icon just disappear? It's offer massage. It's down below. Okay. I guess that's the way to <laughs> disguise myself. Uh, where did I leave my... Consulate security, okay. Ah yes, canteen. I should find my way down. Props for the security crew. It was just through the outside. So I totally didn't need to go all the way through doing that, I could just uh, come here and uh, grab this. I wonder if security crew down downstairs is better or worse. Is that car? Does the camera? Missing key. Ah. That would have been stylish.
Well, you just go that way then. What is in this place? Just a different way. Hello, soldier. Ground. Why can? Why should I poison that? Create a great panic. Please. I just be a jerk. But I... I don't understand. There is no sign of forced entry, no alarms, nothing. One of my people has gone missing in Johannesburg. A key bearer. I wish I'd been informed. Still, the system demands two keys, and the rest are all accounted for. Except for your late predecessors. Comp? But... His plane went down over the Pacific. It was an accident. Such was the conclusion at the time. Yes. I was in the vault again. The bed was empty. People die, Mr. Fannin. Happens all the time, even to us. It seems like a conspiracy. Probably isn't. And yet, the failed coup in Morocco, the ether virus. Someone knows about us. There was a pattern and I failed to see it. Providence is under attack. <clears throat> How much was there? Money. <laughs> Not money, Mr. Fennin. Information. On all of our assets and operatives. Like you. Dig a trench, Director. And make it a deep one, because none of you are safe anymore. Yeah, reminding myself of some of the points of the story. All right. Unhappy ending. Can start as a soldier, huh? <laughs> Maybe I should have this guy myself as a soldier in the <laughs> in the school when I had the chance. Whoa, <laughs> that's a big rating. <coughs> Never spotted, no notice. Ah, I didn't destroy the recordings, yeah. No target kill penalty, none. That was almost perfect. Almost. Alright, let's do one more. What's the next one? Bangkok. Ah, it's the... It's the hotel with the singer. Alright, let's see. I can start at the riverside landing at my suit 
and the undercover as security. Several undercover things. Where can I smuggle stuff? Large agency pick up at the penthouse. Ah, I can put something in my suit. I don't think. Uh, Lockpicks are useful here. Yeah, it works out with key cards and stuff. Now let's just start at the suit. So I can have my battle. Keep the fiber wire. Alright. There are some things. Fault microphone, drowning. <laughs> I really wanted to do the coconut thing, but I failed. <laughs> I got the tuk tuk. Jordan Cross pushing him into the glass roof, yeah, that's poetic in a way. Smothering him on the birthday cake. Okay. Smooth operator redacted. Electrocuting him. Pushing out of the balcony, yeah. Poisoning the cake. Sniper rifle. Oops, I did it again. Another with sniper rifle. Not many interesting things with Ken Morgan. Faulty mic microphone, huh? Most of the stuff's for Jordan Cross. Oh, there is a mm, no pushing off balcony, blah. Sniper, meh. Too easy. The fault. Mm, let's do the poetic one for Jordan Cross. So, pushing him into the glass roof. It's King Morgan that I cannot figure out what good one. But there's a whole thing with uh, becoming uh, a drummer as well. well. Let's see. Let's see. I think I messed it up. To S 
set up here. There we go. So Totally illegal, yes. Is this a fortune cookie? No. Oh, it's a sleeping mask. I was just seeing it through a weird angle. Okay. So. Friends Electric. What happened if I just do the drummer thing? Abel the Silva, who is currently waiting. Let, let's do this and see what happens. I need to disguise myself as Abel the Silva. He's downstairs. To get his stuff, hey. and he's drinking over there. So, uh, when is Dexy Barrett coming to pick me up? I don't know. I just carry the heavy stuff, man. I mean, mm. head up to the studio yourself if you want. No, no, I don't want to see. If I can up, find I'll some wait. poison. And this guy's myself as uh, kitchen stuff. I may be able to just have that guy run to the bathroom. Hello, sir. Uh, sir, you can't go through here. Please turn around. Okay. Or maybe I can find a way in. Who's the jittery guy over there? Looks like another one of those rock stars. Uh, that's Abel Dis. Sorry, mister. I don't give to charity. So please go look for change somewhere else, alright? Yeah, scram, buddy. I already know who Abel da Silva is. Just. Uh, that's Abel da Silva? He's only one of the most hey, buddy. awesome drummers on the New York indie scene. He was in Death in Taxes in and Flat Earth Society? Yeah, I, I like Top 40. Ah. Anyway, the Silva's filling in for the drummer in Jordan Cross's band, who quit yesterday. The record label flew him in. Uh, it took him up to the restaurant lounge. Spare the manager, she's gonna come get him soon. Gee, I guess I should get his autograph. 
you, you, you don't deserve his autograph. You deserve poop in a bag. Interesting. The class's regular drummer unexpectedly quit the band, and the record label has flown in a replacement. Upcoming indie drummer Abel De Silva, who is currently waiting in the restaurant lounge. Better yet, Jordan Cross has not previously met Mr. De Silva, and the two of you do share a resemblance, 47. Oh. There goes my next ex-husband. Indeed. I can make you a widow if you want. Sorry, sir. I will never touch you again. I don't want to spoil the party, but I'm the only one who can. Yeah, probably getting some poison is the way to go. That is Ken the Brick Morgan, lawyer and corporate fixer. Superb. <laughs> so, I need to get access to the employees only areas. Which means I need to disguise myself as an employee, which is the whole idea anyway. I had a lot of trouble getting the... That's the way I got uh, uh, one of back. these guys disguises. Really Maybe I have to pull that off again. I do believe that hmm. behind. Uh, no harm done. Behind here is employee zone. Indeed it is. I thought I was being smart, I wasn't. Who quit yesterday? The record label flew him in, and I took him up to the restaurant lounge. Miss, Miss Barrett, the manager, she's gonna come get him soon. Gee, I guess I should Interesting. The class's regular drummer unexpectedly quit the band, and the record label has flown in a replacement. Upcoming indie drummer Abel De Silva, who is currently waiting in the restaurant lounge. Better Stop yet, rooms. Jordan Cross has not previously met Mr. Yeah, De Silva, and the two of you do share a resemblance, 47. Yeah, I couldn't believe how confident it was. Some fellas are no, like, deep indie vinyl hipster fanatics. They insist that the soft currency EP was better. I like their earlier stuff. So predictable. But to me, Providence is where Jordan and Heidi quite really collect, you know? Hmm. Okay, okay, let, let me tell you this one then. I once installed an air horn Keep under my colleague's chair. It scared the living crap out of me. I mean, literally. I'm hilarious, right? Okay, I have a plan. Let's see if my plan works. I just need to be able to get to employees only areas. And with kitchen stuff too. Yeah, well, we're never excited. Uh, kitchen stuff, kitchen stuff. Where is the freaking kitchen? 
I want that is Ken the Brick Morgan, lawyer and corporate fixer. Okay, kitchen. I guess it's not kitchen stuff that I want, it's waiting stuff. How are you today, Mr. Reed? I don't know. Is this employees only? No, no smoking. This is the WC. You have the uniform I want. Ah, here's a place to this. Okay. I know what to do. Got what I wanted. With a lot less steps than I expected. Yes, I expected some people who know what is up. You won't, okay? Oh! Problem is. You don't have the poison. Well, let's see. Oh, that guy knows what's up. The waiting stuff can go through. Oh, that guy. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Waiter. Waiter. Be careful with the guy that knows what's up here. Heavy sleeper. They're always happy. Well, I'm telling you, every night it is when you cross this to this story. A man and a woman fighting horribly over and over again. Oh, come on. He's just watching TV. One of those, uh, you know, one of those Scandinavian dramas where the people are having Cross's dead girlfriend, the the one who who uh, fell on the roof. No, the other one. Of course, that dead girlfriend. Cross is listening to a recording of himself and Anna Highball fighting. What the? That's what. Well, oh, okay. Well, does it end the screen? No, no. There's a stroke. Then he stops and rewinds. Come on, you, listen to yourself. You're taking a piss, man. <sighs> When's the album coming out? Uh, look, I don't, no idea, man. Fine. So he just stands there and... Okay...
Huh. Okay. No good place to hide a body here. So is this like his private quarters or something? Because regardless... If he stops here for a smoke... I probably can attract him there and do a thing. Unfortunately, that guy might notice it first. Mm. Ling is recording crew. Okay, he's doing his thing. Scared to talk to her, you know. Sounds awesome. Uh, I have no idea, man. You don't know what to do yet. Okay, let Reaction. Reaction. Do you know? That looks like. No, no, no. Okay. No good place to hide him. So I'm just gonna leave him here. Okay. Approach Jordan Cross. Lots of people that know what's up now because uh, the drummer no longer has uh, hair. Where's the loyalty in there? Yeah, the people that actually were clo uh, close to him is not. Oh, I need to go to the other building. Okay. We're doing the drum thing. I do not know how to go. Keep going with it. Why won't you work? Hello, Mr. De Silva. Hello. Anyone here knows me? Yes. Yes. Someone over there. The only one. Oh crap. Let's see. Couple of Lego items, okay. What up, Abel? Hey, Abel. Hello. OK. 
Okay, concealed. Stays here. We can't have just anybody. Mr. Silva, how are you? Understood. You know, lift the finger. What's up, Abel? Hello. Yeah. There was a coin around here. Yeah, on this mess, I could find a coin. I'm keeping it. I could blend in his recording crew. Hi. Wait a second. No frisking. You just don't frisk me. I didn't expect not to be patted. Uh, and those are terrible places for me to just leave my stuff. Okay. Um, need coins. Coins. That wasn't as smooth as the... The other time. But, you know, we were learning as we went. And it was pretty dramatic, to put it mildly. I mean, for our butt. Okay. Why would you work? I forgot the coin. Let me know if you need anything, Mr. Silva. I need to not be recognized. As not Mr. Da Silva. I'll give you the short version, though. Nobody gets in or out except for VIPs and crew. No hotel staff, security, or guest, no matter how chummy with the band and or pregnant they might claim to be. Kitchen staff is the sole exception. Oh, and do try and keep quiet while the band is in session. Jordan is fit. Sensitive today. Any other questions? Ask the internet. Ciao. Mr. Silva, how are you? Hi. I totally didn't expect to not be frisked. Anyone is smart around here? No. Dexie Barrett was supposed to pick you up at the restaurant lounge. <laughs> oh, well, while you're here, who cares? Go right in, sir. Hey, Abel. I'm, I'm a big fan. You know, Death and Taxes are like my favorite band. Appreciate it. <laughs> okay, he's going up. Anybody smart? No. Good. Uh, I'm running. I can do stuff. Spent six days tweaking the spring reverb for Noel Wagner's Rickenbacker until Noel had a nervous breakdown and knocked Wes out cold with a frying pan. 
And this other time, West locked himself in the studio with a loaded revolver, threatened to shoot anyone from the record company who entered before the mix was just right. Yeah, well, still, I mean, to, to risk Jordan's life for a particular vocal sound that, that only he and, and a handful of people in the world will ever notice? As I say, uncompromising. Anyway, it's safe enough when you know how to handle it. Just don't crank the voltage. All right, well, keep that in mind. Swap with. I need to swap the microphone, okay. Conceal item, okay. Yeah, I still don't know. I know how to approach him, I don't know exactly how to kill him. What's up, Abel? Hello. Nobody's that murdered is us here. Jordan Cross, revered and reviled in equal measures. One more feeling. Is that too much to ask? Huh? Am I right? Everywhere here is like a freaking mess. Hello. Do I know you? Oh, hey, you're Quentin's replacement, right? Abel de Silva. Thanks for coming out, eh? Follow me. Play the drums for Jordan Cross. I shall. What does that thing do? Curious now. Fountain. What is that thing? Recording crew. Okay, good stuff. Everyone, this is Abel De Silva. He's here to take over for Quentin. Uh, drums all set up, Wes. Good to go. Cool. So, what do you say, man? Get behind the kid. Show us what you made of. Okay, how do I start? Okay, play drums. <laughs> this is more important than any. <laughs> okay, you can see here. Forty-seven knows his stuff. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, that was cool. All right, you're like some kind of machine, aren't you? Oh man. Nice oh, perfect gun. talk. Okay. Why don't you walk with me, Abe? There's something I want to show you. After you. <laughs> Can I kill him with the katana <laughs> if he brings me to his quarters? Mr. De Silva? Hello? Yeah, so, sorry about the mood around here. You know, Heidi's still pissed about Quentin leaving. But, you know, just don't expect her to roll out the red carpet. So, just do your thing. Do it well. She'll soften up. It's fine. Where are we going? Atrium roof. Look, I want to pitch you something. And I don't want the others to hear. It's bad from around. Atrium roof. Oh, that's interesting. Very interesting. So, you think it'll be a hit? The new class album, I mean. Why would you work? Okay, uh, let me just create uh, a save here just in case I miss uh, my opportunity which happens often because I want to hear what he has to say
climbing the cultural ladder, I see. Good work, 47. I like your style. It's very tight, very new way. You, uh, you should talk to Dexy when we get back to New York. Uh, who's repping you? Small agency. Very low profile. You wouldn't have heard of them. <laughs> Old buddies from school, huh? Don't have the heart to let them go? <laughs> yeah, thought so. But believe me, man, you gotta aim higher. Anyway, so I have this project coming up. Yeah? I think it's right up your alley. Going solo? Yeah, that's the plan. I could use a solid drummer. A hired gun, not a partner. Someone who does the job without getting noticed. Oh. Uh, so you're interested? It's what I do. <laughs> right. yeah. Oh, hold it over. Talk to your people if you have any. You can decide when we get back to New York. Good talking to you, April. Target down. Next up, Ken Morgan. <laughs> Challenge completed. You're so fly. How are you doing, De Silva? Uh, not bad. I just just killed someone. <laughs> I wonder how much um, access do I get with this as the silver? Oh, it's the party place. It's impressive that nobody noticed. Okay. Cracked glass panel. There is a cracked glass panel in the archway above the hotel entrance. They repair me. Contemporary to remove the glass in one piece before one of the roadie crewmen caused an accident. Yeah. Okay. Did I. Uh, what was. Oh, here. There is a fly. It's in the Jordan glass by pushing it into, into the glass roof. Yeah. I did it. And that was kind of what I wanted too. Now, what about Kim Morgan? The tuk tuk has already been done, so it, and all the others are kind of blah. The bodies are already found, so whatever. Jordan Cross or Ed This is sniper rifle. Nah. Okay. Whatever, none of uh are really done need. No longer available, no longer available. Completed on the house. Smoking gun. TikTok. Smoking gun. Let's try this one. Do I have access to it here? No. Why is there a splinker here? Oh no, it's a faucet. That person is the only one that can recognize me. Obnoxious. Ok. 
Okay. Look, you want me to deliver it? Deliver what, mate? The letter, Neil. The one Dexy Barrett told you to take down to reception three hours ago. Oops, sorry. Yeah, so you keep saying. Who's an old four anyway? All the more reason to deliver his letter. So, Dexy Barrett sends a message to the occupant of the Queen Suite, aka Ken Morgan. This must be the reason for Morgan's surprise visit. Sounds promising. Clearly, Barrett doesn't want her client Jordan Cross to know about Morgan's presence, so whatever business the two have, they're likely to do it in secret. I suggest you intercept that message, 47. Could be a chance to catch Morgan off guard. Okay. So that guy has the... I wish she was my manager. Okay. Well, I mean, she's been with Jordan in the class since the beginning. That's different. No place to actually. Hiring Dexy Barrett is the only privileged thing he did. He wanted to prove himself. Do it right and true. You gotta respect that. Yeah, yeah. Still wanna punch him though. Seriously? Why? Jordan's amazing. He's cool, good looking. And let's not forget, he's a kick ass artist. Yeah, you know, I think you just answered your own question. <laughs> Not weird at all that I'm closing all the doors. I wish I had that. Uh... No poison now. I don't want to drown the guy. I do want to drag him. I wonder why I can't, like, do recording crew stuff. Technically, I am recording crew. How are you doing that? <laughs> she just, just stepped over a guy. Okay. So I don't think I want to do this as the drummer. So waiter, casual suit.
Where did they leave the casual suit? Where did they tackle the waiter? Way. Well put. Oh, and that thing I wonder about are the orange cat map. Um this map is sometimes very confusing. That guy knows me. Okay, so we Mr. Ah, yeah. mm -hmm, that's who I am. I right, just the guy I tackled. There we go. Oh. There goes my next ex husband. Well, yes, we could change the subject slightly. I think there's a limit to how many friendly faces and how many exotic visitors. Excuse me, I found this on the stairs. Queen oh, Suite. Um, thank you so much, sir. I'll make sure the letter finds its rightful owner. Okay, where is the guy? Over there. Greetings, sir. Hello, sir. Hi. Can I just... Isn't there anywhere I can just lounge and uh, not look suspicious? He's not. Is he coming? Ah, uh, he's sampling the appetizers. Mr. Morgan, a letter was only just delivered. Here you are, sir. Oh, finally. Basement linen room. Call me when you get there. Dexy Barrett. Well done, 47. Morgan is on the move, and we know exactly where he is headed. We're meeting at the living room. Hmm. Welcome to the exciting world of corporate underhand. <laughs> you can just go there. Uh, sir, you can't go through here. Please turn around. Well, I know where I can find a disguise that might be as help with that. Uh, actually, no, I don't. Okay, 
Okay, it's gonna take some steps. Good day, Mr. Reaper. I could get a new one. Stop that, do you hear me? Oh crap. I just did a suspicious. Huh? <gasps> what? Never mind. Okay. I lost that coin. Ah, oh, whatever. Yeah, things didn't work. Quick, count to ten. One, two, three, oh fuck it. You let him finish. Okay. Welcome to Bangkok, Mr. De Silva. Thank you. Can I go as the Silva? Probably not. Uh, Mr. De Silva, at the moment I can't let you through here. I'm off. Uh, uh, I'm sorry, but it's off limits. Yeah. Um. Okay. So I. I wonder if I can go as a waiter. That's the question. Sure, sure. The tech industry is a pretty wild place, let me tell you. I mean, the office pranks we pull off. Forget about it. That is fascinating. Okay. And waiter disguise. I was still carrying the points. Okay. I was, I was actually kind of scared of him. Now he was like, yes, sir, no, sir. Okay, that guy knows what's up. That guy knows what's up. Glass what about you two? Vermont, please. Thank you. Hey, waiter. I can get in. Nice. I got a couple of 
covered, okay? Besides, even at very large doses, this compound is not lethal for humans. I mean, okay, yeah, sure, it knocks you out for a bit. And, uh, yeah, yeah, give you a headache, probably, but, uh, I mean, that's about it. Imagine the lawsuits. Whoa, not gonna happen, Chief. Believe it or not, I've done this before. Uh, where is the guy? Waiting tables like your life depended on it. Good job. Indeed. My life probably depends on it. I'm grabbing everything I see. <laughs> oh, I can hide something here. What is this? Bullet ventilation, okay. Where is he? I lost him completely. Okay. That's pretty darn far away. Opportunities, opportunities. Um. Well, <laughs> you're no quitter. We've got to give you that. Look, I can fix it. Are you sure you don't want a ride home? It's not about that. Thomas Cross. Is he back to his usual shenanigans? Have I lost my opportunity because I did something wrong? I probably did. I probably should have been disguised as a waiter from the get-go. I think it is this wrong. Okay. Uh Okay. So let's do let's be a waiter. Deli before we deliver. Hello? Hey, who did 
this for you. Holy shit! I need help! Oh, thank God, there you are. There is trouble. <sighs> Crap. How did I manage to, like, just go in without a problem? Last time. Cigarettes in the bar? No? no. Good. Ah, yes. yes. I guess some people are just born with these sensibilities. Either you put them in art or you end up in the madhouse. Or both, like I go. Yeah, I see what you mean. I think. So. So that guy knows what's up. Says Queen Suite on the envelope. I see. Very well, I'll take care of it. Okay. I think we can just stay here. Uh, no place for me to disguise as a waiter, though. It's gonna take a while to come. All right. What do I have on me? I have the baton, the gun. I have a wrench. And I have the fiber wire. Come on, dude, come here. This assassination business requires a lot of patience. And I should not keep slowing down the freaking time by doing the... Secret vision thing. Ah, oh, there he comes. Yeah. Thank you for thank for thanks for saving me. Ken Morgan, any messages for me? Let me check. Yes, Mr. Morgan. A letter was only just delivered. Here you are, sir. Oh, finally. Basement linen room. Call me when you get there. Dexie Barrett. Well done, 47. Morgan is on the move, and we know exactly where he is headed. We're meeting at the linen room. Mm. Welcome to the exciting world of corporate underhand dealings. Hey, 
What's a decent tip, man? 10, Hold 15%? On. Have I 12? seen you before somewhere? Look at him. What's Are his you? problem? Who knows this guy? You don't fool me for one second. Are you kidding me? Well done, 47. Morgan is on the move, and we know exactly where he is headed. Smile for that extra tip. Excuse me, are you quite sure that this pesticide so close to the Whoa, whoa, relax, Chief. I got it covered, okay? Besides, even at very large doses, this compound is not lethal for humans. I mean, okay, yeah, yeah, sure, it knocked you out for a bit. I, yeah, it'd give you a headache, probably, but, uh, I mean, that's about it. Uh, hey, yeah, um, yeah, you know, get a lot of roses, because, uh, I just remembered it's my anniversary, so, uh, I need a, I need a big order of roses. Yeah, just as many, what, what do you do, a dozen? Do a dozen. No, do two. Someday you may own your own restaurant. I'll pay double. Great, thank you. So this is the linen room. A uh, note from hotel manager, Mr. Reaper, internally requested total privacy. All staff are strictly prohibited to enter Mr. Reaper's rooms unless specifically instructed to. Needless say, failing to comply will result in immediate termination. Must be yeah. Place. Wait outside, please. Negotiations are best done. If you think that's best, sir. Okay. Ah, if there was a safer way to do it. Go on, go check it out. Fudge. All right, all right. I'm doing everything wrong here. Well done, 47. Morgan is on the move, and we know exactly where he is headed. Welcome, Garcon! See? The linen room. The 
it's through here, hey, uh, then... Hey, uh, yeah. Yeah. I, I just wanted to confirm the reservation. He noticed me and called his buddy. Maybe I should just wait here and Miss Barrett! Something queer about this. Very queer. Both targets down. Now head towards an exit. There is one right there. Kind of right there. Uh, I hope it wasn't disgusting. No, it's just stupid. Someone left their wallet in their pockets. And it had at least a couple of thousand bucks. Why don't people check their pockets? I don't know. Never disrespect. Waiter? Especially not the elder. Anyway, just a little bit upset by Copy that, you know? I just grabbed into ammo. <laughs> Taking the stuff exit. So the thumb drive was the one with the recording. Now I remember. about the shadow client so I did the drum thing all right I never remember to destroy the recordings but I got spotted as well <laughs> Alright, I did drum. I did the, the drums. The drums were drummy. The drums were a hit. Oh yeah. 
The drills were a freaking hit. And that's gonna be it for today. Uh, we will be going to Colorado on uh, Wednesday at 8 p.m. Jump to the street. So, yeah. That's when Hitman will be back. Uh, next uh, Saturday, 3 p.m., I'll be playing an uh, old Genesis game called The Haunting at 3 p.m. Next uh, Sunday, 3 p.m., I'll be playing more Invisible Ink. And at 7 p.m., not sure yet, but we'll be playing there. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. I am the Plane Shifter, and I am phasing out. Bye.